Well, all righty, box pros. What's going on? It's Rage Box here, and welcome to a brand new JRPG playthrough. Another one I've never done before. Uh, Chrono Trigger. I'd say pretty iconic as far as JRPGs go. And from that opening, it seems like it's going to be a pretty nutty game. <laughs> like, holy shit, but I love, love, love. As most of you guys know, I'm a huge Dragon Ball Z fan. And so the fact that the artwork is from Akira Toriyama, it's like the same artwork as Dragon Ball Z, I think that's fucking incredible, and I cannot... Let's do it. What's up, Feek? What's up, Dax? What's up, Rain? What's up, Evolution? Dr. Noble, howdy. How you doing, Jesse? Arena, of course. Rain, welcome, guys. Lele Mun. So good to see so many of you here for the new PlayStation Saturdays. Game. I am ready to go on my new RPG adventure that I've never done before. I never played this one, guys. Never got around to it. I was too busy with Final Fantasy and Legend of Ligaia and all that stuff. I just never really played any off-brand, like, really niche. At the time, they were more niche, you know? Like, today, they're pretty popular, but... Like, uh, like, 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 uh, what's the one called? Like, The Legend of Mana or whatever the hell, and, you know, Chrono Trigger, Chrono Cross... Those, I just never really got into them, so. But it's cool, you know, I get to play it now. So it looks like we can go between the active time battle and the wait battle system. There's a choice. That's really interesting. They give you an option. I'm going to go with the active to make it a little more challenging. How goes it? What's up, Johnny? How you doing, dude? Hey, oh, we get to name our guy! Usually, I just go with the default name for, like, the sake of the playthrough, you know, but I mean... I don't see why we can't name him something else, you know? Why not? Wait, how do you move over? Oh shit, hold up. How do you, wait, how do you move over? There we go, okay. Um, thanks for the like spike, Johnny. Wh what do you guys think? I, wh what should we name him, just Rage or something? Should I name him Zalison, one of my aliases? I don't know. I'm open to suggestions, guys. Bob? Kappa, Kappa's going with Bob. I, Bob is kind of nice. Nice and simple. Serena says it should just be Rage. Maybe. Dingus. <laughs> We're going to save Dingus for, for... We'll probably name somebody Dingus. We probably will, but not the main character. The return of Dingus. Boxy Beep. Arjury? Wingus? I don't know, guys. So far, I think Bob, dude. Bob is taking it for me. I, I just really like Bob for some reason. I was thinking maybe in all caps. Just Bob. <laughs> Frederick? No, no, too, ma too much. Frederick's like too much of a name. Bobby? Bobby? Uh, maybe. Bob or Bobby? I'm thinking Bob, guys. I don't know. I, it's really... I'm really liking it. You know, I'm going... Bimbo. Oh, my God. I'm going with Bob, guys. Thanks for that one, uh, Blah. I appreciate it. Fucking Bob. Our hero. Bob. May he ever reign supreme. This is the start of it, guys. Let's go. Now, it's not too often I play a really classic RPG like this. Like... Like, 8-bit RPG. Like, I very rarely play these, so... Be interesting. What's kind of party going on in this town? Thanks for the like, Spike Shelley. I pity the fool who faces Bob! Me too, dude. We can name him My Dude, and then everybody who says his name <laughs> is a chill dude. Yeah, what up, my dude? Bob? Bob! Oh, Jesus. Good morning, Bob! Now, is his real name Robert, or is his actual name just Bob? That's my question. Oh, shit! Come on, sleepyhead, get up! Yo, it is literally like a classic... Like, getting woken up by your mom kind of RPG. Like, it starts off, you're at home. It's like Pokemon. <laughs> What's up, Tim? How you been, dude? Uh, uh, Lene's Bell makes such beautiful music. 
Then I so excited about the millennial fair that you didn't sleep well, did you? Millennial fair. I want you to behave yourself today. How does this game know I'm a millennial, dude? Get moving now. Whatever, mom. I love it. I just walk out of bed. I can't go back in. Okay, this is cool. Getting the hang of it. <sighs> Close these dreams. Oh my god, it worked. <laughs> <laughs> like mom opening up my drapes, I'm a vampire. I don't like the sun coming through. Is there anything I can get in my room before I leave? There might be a potion in here or something, you never know. Hey, thanks for the like, Spike Nabet. Yeah, I love that classic, like, like, it's a game that starts off, you're just in your room being woken up by your mom. It's like, little do you know you're about to be thrust into a epic fucking adventure. Let's check out the menu. Oh, this is interesting. Bob level one, we got the wood sword. Okay, we got some stuff. The hide cap, hide tunic, uh, and a bandana. Okay. Lightning. I guess people have elements in this game. That's, that's cool. Okay, so that's like the character screen. Items. Tech. Spin cut nearby enemies. I must. Okay, so they're like special abilities. hell's all this? Oh, stereo on, battle mode active, save menu cursor? Save battle cursor? That's weird. And... Oh, so you can customize. That looks pretty good, though. As long as confirm is on X, I'm happy. Like, I hate it when RPGs put confirm on circle. It just confuses the hell out of me, man. Yeah, I heard uh, the soundtrack is great on this game, Leon. I'm looking forward to it. Bob and his wooden sword, dude. Yep, getting up in the morning with that wooden sword. You know how it is, dude. You know how it is. Oh, that's... Guys, it's literally Legend of Lagaya. Hold up. That is straight... Okay, with the yellow borders... Like, if you replace the white borders with yellow borders, this would be Legend of Lagaya. 110%. Oh my god, I'm keeping it. I love it, dude. What's this? I guess you could swap characters. Is this how you save? I guess you can only save in certain areas. Like most JRPGs. Okay, I'm ready to go, dude. Thought it was Chrono Cross. Uh, guess I watch a bit of your gameplay. This is Chrono Trigger, my friend. Chrono Cross is apparently the sequel to Chrono Trigger, right? That's what I heard. Finally. Uh, by the way, the inventor, f that inventor friend of yours, uh, you know. Oh dear, I've forgotten her name. What are we gonna name somebody else now? Please tell me we're gonna name somebody else. Oh my god. Luca? Like the city in, in, in... Spira? <laughs> oh, with two C's? Okay. What are we naming her, boys? Is she gonna be Dingus? <laughs> I'm gonna change the whole cast's names, guys. I'm doing it. Should she be Dingus? Really? A girl named Dingus? I don't know. No, I think we gotta save Dingus for somebody else. Maybe the frog character, dude. Maybe the frog character can be Dingus. Name her Bob, too. <laughs> Just everybody's Bob. Angus Seta. No, no. Willow? Willow's kind of nice. Bobby? <laughs> no, no, nothing close to Bob. <laughs> That'd just be so stupid. Just everybody's a variant of Bob. Like, one person's Robert, another person. <laughs> Wait, that'd be kind of funny, actually. But no, I kind of, well, yeah, Willow is kind of nice. Velma. She does have glasses. Wait a minute. And she seems like she's probably a big fat nerd. We might go with Velma, guys. Can we fit it? Yeah, we can definitely fit it. We can just about fit it. We can just fit it perfectly. We're doing it. 
That's right, Velma! Don't forget uh, that she invited you to see her new invention. Run along now and be back before dinner. Oh, okay then, cool. Yo, do I have a cat? Yo, the cat's following me around! Oh, shit. Aww. Get me out, dude. That's so sweet. Alright, so we gotta go to Velma's house and see her new invention. Good lord. What up, Ace Boogie? How you doing, dude? Uh, oh, I almost forgot. Uh, here's your allowance, dear. Have fun at the fair. Two, 200 gil? Hell fucking yeah, Mom. Thank you. Fucking get it. Good thing I talked to her. All right, see you later, kitty. You be good. You do need to play Legend of Lagaya. If none of you guys have ever played Lagaya, you, 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 get on it. Get on it. We got the truce in... Mayor's Manor. Now, my friend told me it's impossible to run into battles in the open world, like the world map, so... Might do a little exploring before we go and, uh... Talk to our friend Velma, I guess. Oh, shit, dude. There are knights, and... Is this an alien? Hello? A fucking alien, dude? Buddy. Welcome to the Millennial Fair. Have fun. Oh, you can walk around, like, while in a chat box. That's cool. Oh, you can't... Okay, not with everybody. This is Lenny Square. They say people hear Lenny Bell... Lenny's bell ring will have interesting and happy lives. Wow. Oh, we got shops. Let's get it. Okay, um... We got the Karate Gi and the Bronze Helm. Do we really need this stuff now, though? I don't know. They're kind of expensive. Like, we can buy them both, but they're kind of expensive. So, I'm gonna wait. I don't know if we're gonna need that stuff right away. I like to be sparing with my money at the start of these games. Aw, what's Huffy? Ooh, we got tonics. Okay, so that restores 50. Store status? Heal? I'm guessing that must be like a remedy, and it's the same as a tonic, only 10? That's not bad. Revive instead of Phoenix Down, it's just called Revive, and then Shelter. Okay. Again, don't know if we're gonna need this stuff right away. What items do we have right now? Do we have anything? Listen closely to the music right? Oh, the huh? Yeah. <laughs> I know, I know what you're talking about now. Yeah, we got no items. Usually the game starts you off with some kind of items, but... That's, that's interesting. We don't got nothing. Oh, we're just going to go visit our friend. I doubt anything crazy is going to happen. But I, I know where these shops are now, and I'll come back to them when we need stuff. I'm guessing this is probably the armor shop. Oh, the race is on. Be quiet and watch. You tell him to be quiet. Buy something from Melchior, the swordsmith? Okay. Oh, the other guy was the armor guy. What am I saying? I meant the, I meant the weapon guy. The weapon guy. This is the weapon guy. Oh my, a load sword. It'll give me 17 attack. Jesus. 4,000 gil. I'm just saying gil. It's, it's, it's just G's. Probably just gonna call it, call it gil. Well, this will raise it by two, and this will raise it by fucking nine. Like, good lord, yeah. Maybe I'll save up money for this sword, boys. Like, aren't you gonna buy something, young man, you piece of shit? I live on the continent to the east. Come see me sometime. Uh, <laughs> listen, old man. <laughs> what are you talking about? Renowned Tent of Horrors? Spend your silver points here? Parental discretion advised. Uh oh. Fuck is. Welcome to the Norse. The Norstein Beckler's Lab. Spine tingling shadow is about to. Silver points would you like to pay? I don't think I have any, but 10? 
Have no point. Getting out of here, guys. I don't know what the fuck that was. Like a floating head with hands. Like what the hell? Fucking spooked. How do you get? How do you get silver points? Now you, got, you got to play games or something? Big deal. So what if uh, we won a war against a wizard a hundred years ago? Wait, what? Won a war against a wizard? Are you? Are these the racing guys? Is this what you're talking about? You can bet on them? That did kind of sound like Kefka's laugh. Know it? It's the green amber. So how do you bet on them? This. I heard Velma and her dad have made a cr another crazy invention. Hope it doesn't blow up like all the others. Blow up, jeez. So much fun watching you discover this game, Rage. It, it is a lot of fun. I thank you. The kingdom's been through a lot, like the war against Magus 400 years ago. Thank goodness things are so peaceful now. Apparently there was some war against a wizard a long time ago, but they... Press the X button while facing the bell. Judge your distance carefully and press the X button. Okay. Oh, I get it. Ooh, almost, almost. Okay, hold up, hold up. You can do this. Boom! Let's get it. Impressive! I'll put one silver point on your card. Cool! Got one silver point, boys. Gunners are busy racing, so they won't talk to you. So you don't even have to buy it, dude. You could um, you could play it for free on an emulator on your uh, PC. If you have, well, if you have one. Get, uh... PSXE. What's up here? Talk to the guy in the tent when they line up again? Oh, okay. Whoa, what the fuck? Hey! What the hell just happened? Ouch, that hurt. What the frick was that all about? I'm oh, sorry, are you okay? Uh oh, my pendant. Yeah, it's, it's literally over here. Say it. Clear as day. Get me, lady? Oh, thank goodness, my pendant. It has a lot of sentimental value. Can I have it back? No. I <laughs> could you imagine? Just like, nah, you can't have it back. The hell with you? <laughs> I'm keeping it. And then it sells for 4000 dude. Could you imagine? <laughs> oh, yeah, you can have it. Came to see the festival. You live in this town, don't you? Still a little out of place here. Uh, would you mind if I walked around with you for a while? Ah, uh, I mean, I guess, why not? You're a true gentleman. Oh, by the way, the name is, er... Wait, what? Another character? Oh, it's her, okay. Arl? Arl, huh? What a great name. Unfortunately, <laughs> we're back to the name and game, guys. Name her Rain. She's my favorite character in the game. Really? Bobette. <laughs> Will Rain fit? Yeah, it should. Well, like, even with the E, yeah. Alright, well, you did put this game on the list, Rain, and, uh, I guess since she's your favorite character, we, we can go with Rain, that's fine. Um, Rain, and you're... Bob? What a nice name. He's a silent protagonist, isn't he? I fucking love silent protagonists in these kinds of games, guys. Oh, I'm happy as hell. What a nice name. Pleased to meet you. Now lead on. I love the silent protagonist, dude. Oh, this is great. All right, we got it. We got a girl, dude. Easy peasy. Go to the fair. Pick up a bitty, dude. No fucking biggie, guys. You have one silver point. To exchange ten silver points for fifty. Oh, you can exchange points for Gil. That's interesting. Well, I don't have ten, so. Huh. 
Right? So there are like seven characters in this game. Well, I know that, but I didn't think we'd be running into them in such quick succession. I hate fairs. Say, do you know the latest gossip? No. Yes. I heard that the king is distressed over his tomboy of a daughter. For a second, I thought it said Tom Barry. Just once, I would like to see how wild she really is. Huh. Well, setting up. Why don't you come back in a while? Setting up for what? You guys twins? Yeah. Hello? Man, well, where's my cat? Cat. Soda guzzling contest. Press the X button as fast as you can. Ready, set, go. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. Uh... Oh god, I feel like Metal Gear, Metal Gear Solid again, dude. Only seven cans, is that the best you can do? What? You're awfully competitive, aren't you, Bob? I'll, I'll, I'll try again, hold up. Here we go. Come on, come on, come on. Dude, holy shit. You gotta really mash the button. Oh my god. Okay, hold on, hold on. I can do this, I can do this. Come on. Nah, I goofed up, I goofed up. Couldn't even get seven that time, fuck. This is tough, dude. How am I gonna get eight cans? I'll come back to this in a little bit. I'll let my finger rest. <laughs> my thumb, dude. Yeah, his poor stomach. Like, good lord. But isn't this, like, medieval times? Like, I like how they have soda. Time to talk. I'm just, uh, sitting down for my lunch. Oh, here's the cat. Hey, kitty, follow me. Oh, don't get stuck on things. Dude, we got a we got a girl following us. We got a cat following us. <laughs> Come on, kitty. That's your cat, kid. I brought back my cat. Thank you. You're so sweet, Bob. Aren't I just the sweetest? Butter bear. <laughs> it's butter bear. <laughs> going if you want to demo Velma's robot battle trainer? What? What are we doing? What the f What is this? They call me Gato. I have metal joints. Beat me up and earn 15 silver points. Okay. Uh-oh. Oh shit, hello? Whoa, what the fu- What is this? Yo, what is this battle system? Please punch me in the face! What the hell? Dude, I'm getting socked in the jaw! Oh, I have a technique? I thought I did. Screw you, buddy! God damn it! <laughs> it's like a little, it's like a little uh, boxing glove on a fucking. Oh, we got him! Cool. That was a nice little crash course into the battle system. I lost you one. Here's fifteen points. That wasn't that fun. He was hitting me in the head with his crotch, dude. <laughs> That's exactly what that was. Can we just keep fighting him over and over again? Wait, are, is our health still fucked up? Yeah, it is. Look, we got 17 out of uh, 70. Oof. And, oh, the pendant? The pendant, do. Is that an equipment?
What can I not? Oh, tech points need... I need four tech points, I guess, in order to learn this? Or equip it? She has aura. Store allies. Oh, HP, that's cool. You need nine points for that. She's got a ribbon? No, well, there's no way that that does what normal ribbons do. Like in Final Fantasy, I mean. I like how her element is water. We named her Rain. That's kind of that's kind of perfect. Water, my favorite element. Let's get it. All right. Well, now that we got 15 points, I mean, now we can go to that haunted house and see what the hell that's about. A little scared, but. Hey, move it, old man. Stop. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try uh, drinking the soda again. <laughs> All right, buddy, I'm ready. Third time's the charm, dude. Dude, it's impossible. It's impossible. You got a really button mash. I can't, dude. It's so, it's so impossible. There's no way. Or you can exchange the points for Gil and get the load sword. Dude! Hold up. It's 10, isn't it 10 points for 50 Gil? Let me see. You have 16 silver points. Which, yeah, 10 points for 50 Gil. It would take... Uh, it'd take a lot of silver points, let's just say that. It would take a lot. I do want to get the load sword, I do. But like, I don't know. I'm gonna go see what the haunted house is about. I'm, I'm, I'm curious. The turbo pads, yeah. If I had something like that, then uh, it would be no problem. Oh no, one, yeah, one point for 50? Oh, that'd be easy. What's up, buddy? <laughs> it's just Kefka. <laughs> Welcome to North Sign, right? How many silver points? Was I guess 10. Oh. Fix. Wedge. Wedge. I'm Piet. They're like, prepare to die, and <laughs> they just get out guns and start shooting us. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, I didn't know that that's what I was supposed to do! I wasn't paying attention! What? Oh, no! Which one is it, guys? Am I timed? Oh, God. Were you guys paying attention? Oh, please tell me you guys were paying attention. I was not. I was not paying attention. Dude, I think it's- is it this guy? Oh, no, guys. Guys, where's Vex? Were you were you guys please tell me you guys were paying attention? Big panic. Oh my god, no! Well, we got a one and third chance, I guess. <laughs> I did not know that that's what I was supposed to be doing here. Alright. I think I think it's this guy. And Vex, we did it! Is it that obvious? It's a Yozo doll? They'll spruce up your room. What? What's a Poyazo doll? What'd they give me? Oh. Hey. I 
guess it's nothing I can actually use. That kind of feels like a waste. Damn it. Oh well. Well, let's go see if we can fight the robot again. Wait a minute. Yeah, my health is still low. I could probably go home and, like, rest or something, right? To score my HP? Or I could just buy a tonic. Maybe we just buy a tonic. Oh, this is the wrong, uh... Wrong store! Or stay at the inn? How much does the inn cost? Probably costs the same as a tonic, doesn't it? Let's go check it out. We'll go to the inn. Me and, me and my new lady friend are gonna go sleep at the inn. <laughs> like, we're... <laughs> like we're literally supposed to be visiting What's-Her-Face. Quaint place. So, lodging is ten gil. What do you know? Go, oh, dude. All right. Is there anything in here? The box has been in the family for generations. Open it, and you may have what's inside. Sealed by a mysterious force. What? Hey, it's a little weird. A little tune was a bit unsettling, but... Okay then, so I'm gonna go back to the fair and I'm gonna see if I can fight the robot again and get more points. And maybe we will just save up enough points to get enough gill to get that sword, dude. And then I'm gonna be ballin'. Oh, what a badass sword, dude. Get it. How do you how do you bet on these guys racing though? I bet you that's also easy point. Then again, you never know who's gonna win. You fight the robot uh, about six times, you should have over 80 points to exchange. forgetting I could sprint, so. What up, Luigi? All right, dude, we're playing Chrono Trigger. Ready for you, you robo bastard. Oh, that was a crit. God damn it. He really doesn't like Bob, dude. <laughs> he really doesn't like Bob. Big damage. Oh, I leveled up! We both leveled up! Nice! Lost you one, here's 15 points, and that wasn't that fun. Okay, um, so since we leveled up, does our HP restore when we level up? That'd be awesome. No, it doesn't. So we're gonna... I guess it's like we gotta heal every time. Which is like... 10 gil if we if we healed five times right then that's the equivalent of 10 points 50 gil so i think we should still yeah we should still be able to make money farming this guy i'm gonna check though maybe i could sleep at my house for free No, it does look like a Dr. Eggman robot. Wait a second, this isn't my house. 
Who are you? Hard to believe Guardia is now a thousand years old, and our king is the 23rd descendant to the throne. How can he rule a kingdom when he can't even control his own daughter? There's my house. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait. Oh, don't mind me, Mom. Just bringing a girl upstairs. No big deal. <laughs> nothing going on here. Uh, nothing, uh, nothing going on here at all. Yo, we can... Guys, we can literally just sleep for fucking free at my goddamn house, dude. Let me see if it restored my HP and MP. Should have. Yes, it did. Easy pe Dude, we get free, free farming, boys. It's free farming. I can't pass this up. I can't pass this up. I don't care if it's episode one, dude. Oh, no, that's okay, Rain. Wait, if we go to Velma's, right, and we talk to her and continue the story, will she join the party and then it can be three of us fighting the bot? Because then that would be even quicker. Like, that would be much quicker than just two of us, but... Like how she has a crossbow. Come on, body boy, let's go. Both level two now, let's see how much we've improved. Not bad. Or I was hitting like 15s. Seems like he does less damage than me too. Fox, guess what? What's up? It's free farm estate, dude. Now he's punching rain. We might be able to get a couple fights in without having to go uh, snooze. Yeah, we beat him. Fucking beat me. Lost you on, you're 15 points, that wasn't that fun. It was very fun, dude. Fight me again. <laughs> what do I gotta like leave the area and come back? Space is dead again, possibly for the fourth time. What what are you watching my dead space let's play? Okay, yeah, you gotta like leave and come back. Yes, I have played The Legend of Dragoon, another incredible JRPG that I love very much, and one day I'll definitely play it here on the channel. <laughs> it's such a comical attack. Like the most goofy shit. Oh, you saw- wait, what? Dead Space 4? No fucking way. I gotta finish that DLC of Dead Space 3 eventually. <laughs> kind of fell off the wagon with it. But I'll get back to that eventually. And if they're doing a Dead Space 4, oh boy. Well, yeah. Alright, now we should have four tech points. Um, so maybe we can use that Cyclone move now? I don't know how it works. I don't know. I got no clue. Oh, it says I need one. I guess I need one more tech point. Maybe? I don't know. You think we can fight him one more time? It might be risky. 20 and 39 health? Yeah, that's too risky. Just, let's go sleep and then come back. Oh, you want me to play Xenogears? Well, either subscribe to the Tier 3 or Tier 4 Patreons, my dude. On the Tier 3, you can choose to put a, uh, a game on the PlayStation Saturday's poll. 
This was actually Rain's game that she picked, and now we're playing it. Or with a tier 4, you could just straight up choose a game for me to stream. Tier 4 Patreon, you can just be like, I want you to stream this game on Wednesdays, and I'll just be like, well, I gotta do it now. Look, there are a few games that I won't do. A few exceptions, but only a few. Get boxing glove, dude. No, I'm not getting my hopes up. I just... I've always heard that they were they were done after three and they weren't planning on ever doing another, so... And one day we'll play Vandal Hearts. <laughs> Maybe. If somehow people vote for it. Vandal Hearts is as good as a tactic game as, as Final Fantasy Tactics, in my opinion. Really good. Not a lot of people know about it, and it's a shame. X2? What are you, what are you talking about, Evolution? I have no... What is Evolution talking about, guys? Well... But I never guessed the first episode of this playthrough would be me farming some fat bot in a fair. <laughs> but, uh, here we are, boys. Here we are. He's done already. Holy shit. There you go. We got Cyclone. Sweet. Try it out now. Pride never ends. I really don't think this will take that long, to be honest with you. The stronger we get, the easier the grind gets. Like I'm, I'm sure that like eventually we'll just be like two shotting him. The bitch. Ham this time. Hey C Mac, how you been? I've never played this one before, so this is a first for me. And so far I'm having a good time. Ooh, we're both level three now, let's go. Like, you know what? I'm sick of this shit. And he just gets out a fucking gun and shoots us. <laughs> sequel to Final Fantasy X? What are you talking about, dude? Final Fantasy X doesn't have a sequel. Oh, what you're talking about? Nice to say, uh... I wouldn't have had... Wait. Oh, you wouldn't want to have spoiled? Yeah, please. No spoilers, guys. Please. Damn, these quick attacks. Oh my god, we might get knocked out. Yep, we're knocked out. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Bot's about to end our whole fucking career, guys. Too far away to counterattack. That's good. What the fuck? Kill him. Kill him. Yeah, 40 damage. Hell yeah, Rain. Okay, that was a little close. Be a little more careful with this guy. Go sleep. Holy shit. Work it. Can you save on the world map, guys? I gotta check that out because I want to save. We could save state just in case. But yeah, and I forgot about Cyclone. Yeah, I already fucking forgot. <laughs> hey, yo, Gothic. I'm glad you're here, dude. What's up? So happy you're finally playing this. Me too, man. I'm having fun so far. Bob getting slapped about. Poor Bob, dude. All right, let's save then. Yeah, here we go.
Gothic, you know, you know what we're doing? We're farming the bot at the fair, so I can try and get that sword that's worth four thousand dollars early. <laughs> I am on YouTube, man. There should be some links there on Twitch that'll take you right over to uh, my YouTube channel. Would be awesome if you joined us on YouTube. I do consider it my main platform. Yeah, most of my uh, my peeps are over here. Got the doll? I do. Oh, what is it in? The, oh, is it in my room? I didn't even notice it. Yeah. <laughs> Next time we go back, I'll look for it. Yup, this bot up. Oh boy. Omigato. I punch you with my Robo Dicko. Get him. I don't know, is he getting a little tougher, or is it just me? Yeah, I forgot the cyclone again, dude. I'll, I'll do it next time. What up, Shark? Here be my first playthrough, Chark, so. Not know too much about it, but. So far, like a good game. Damn it! It really does not look too proper. Okay, so how do we do it? Oh, so it costs MP. Holy bejesus! That was pretty fucking cool. Nito. And once we get her tech that heals? Oh shit, dude, we'll be in the big money. We'll be able to farm him probably like 10 times in a row before we have to go sleep. Imagine if the glove was steel instead. Yeah, I'm gonna have to thank Velma, I guess, for building him uh, <laughs> with that handicap. Like, you could have put a steel glove on him, but you didn't, so thank you. <laughs> like, hey, why are you guys level 6 and I'm still level 1? <laughs> I'm like, well, you see, um... God. Take this! There, she learned it. She learned Aura. Wait, what? Learns dual tech Aura Whirl? She learned two? No fucking way. I'm surprised they put a way to farm, like such a simple way to farm so early in this game. Dual techs are awesome? How do they work? Oh, so, uh, oh my god, 85? <laughs> Holy shit. We probably won't be getting that one for a while. Oh, I learned Aura Whirl. It says restores allies eight. Wait, no, it's for both of us, right? That's what a dual tech is. Allies HP. Um, is it the same? Wait, so does Aura just restore re restore her HP, and Aura Whirl will restore both of our HPs? Is that how it works? I guess so. And then she's got Provoke? Oh, Confuse Enemy, okay. 
Very interesting. I'm telling you guys, listen. Okay, I'm gonna go turn in all my points now and we'll see how much money we get. It is gonna take a little while, but... I wish you could just exchange, like, there was an option to exchange everything at once. They had something similar to this in Legend of Lagaya, Muscle Dome, but you were able to, like, input how much you wanted to trade all at once if you wanted to. I got no clue what you're talking about, Evolution, and, um, I highly suggest stop talking about it. We don't talk about that here. How much money we got now? Look at that, 1,290. So, we basically... I can't do the math in my head right now, but... I'd say another, like, what, half hour and we'll be done this? If that... Hey, yo, what up, Delic? I'm gonna do... Well, I'm gonna try out that healing uh, move. Hopefully it works. So I can use the dual tech too? Okay. Damn, son! Okay, then. Like, okay. I know we can farm this guy a lot now. What does that do? Like, it has a chance to put her to sleep or confuse her or something like that? Easy, dude. Be healed, my son! That was crazy, it like changed the color of the map for a second. Buddy shit, dude. Alright, easy farming, guys. Real easy farming. notice when Bob used the dual tech, did it use his mana or did it use Reigns? Alexandra, how you been? Or Alejandra, sorry. How you been? Welcome. Metal joints, beat me up. Arm my points. Oh, it looks so wrong as attack. It just does not look right. Am I going for a hundred percent? I really don't know yet. Maybe. It all depends what a hundred percent entails. Usually on my first ever playthroughs of games, I don't end up doing 100%. And we gotta heal again. Give me my points. Bob's. Bob's and Vagine. Dude, we should- Oh my god, wait a minute. Why didn't we name him Bob's and we could have named her Vagine, dude? Oh my god, that would have been incredible! Why didn't anybody think of that? Damn it, Box Bros, you failed me again. <laughs> 
Oh, I wish too, Boogie. I wish. Maybe one day. I appreciate you saying that, though. Literally... Could have named her... Could have named her Vagine and him Bob's, dude. That would have been incredible. Okay, I think that used his MP. It's sliced. So can she... Okay, so she can just heal me directly as well. Nice! Okay, we're in business, guys. We're in fucking business. And this is good, because while I'm farming, I'm learning the battle system, too. I really do like this battle system. Like, instead of the breakaway and then you're in, like, a new area and all that, you're literally on the same field in the same positions. Really interesting. Did it say Gato leveled up? Or did it say one of us leveled up? It must have said Bob. Out of the corner of my eye, it looked like Gato for a second. Like, is he leveling up with us? I wouldn't be surprised if he got stronger, too. Chrono what? What's up, Kane? How you doing? It's Chrono Trigger, dude. Trick with a T. Okay, come on, dude. Come on now, that ain't right. Yeah, Bob, Bob's and Bajin is like a meme, yeah. Like, please send Bob's and Bajin. <laughs> I told you, we're basically like two-shotting at this point. Tifa's Armin, dude. But I might do, let's do a save state. Just in case, you know, you never know. <laughs> you never know. I really hate. I mean, EPSXE, it likes to crash sometimes, so. Play it safe. Give me your sweet points. We're hitting 30s now. Like, like in the beginning, we were critting 30s. Now we're just base hitting 30s. Where Robbie Rotten comes in and kills your party? Why the hell? What? <laughs> What's up, gamer? Thank you for the like spike, dude. How you been? Farming is easy peas. That 4,000 gil sword will be ours, boy. And we gotta make a little extra on top of the 4,000 so we're not like completely broke after we buy it. I'm winning, dude. Damn it, we won. I was gonna heal. Can we heal in the menu or only in like battle? Check that out. Yeah, I know this is a port. It was originally on SNES. Oh, sweet! Holy shit. Can heal in the fucking menu with the text. That's that's great. Doki then. Call me Gato. I have a fat Bato. I hit you in the face with it. Fucking hurt. Do I draw? Uh. Kinda, but not really. <laughs> I only draw when I'm like editing like a meme for like one of my pages or 
something in like one of the Let's Plays. But it's nothing like skillful. It's really crazy. To the points. Hey David, what's up, man? Thank you for the like, Spike. Appreciate all these likes, guys. If you haven't hit us with the like yet, uh, please do so. Really does help the stream a lot. YouTube algorithm and all that stuff, you know. Get more, uh, more cr chrono trigger lovers in here. <laughs> I wreck them a lot, dude. Oh, this ain't good. Oh, God. Oh, oh boy. This ain't good. He goes after me the most. You guys ever notice that? So I wonder if Bob got that experience, died, so like maybe he doesn't get it. But probably not. If that's the case, usually more experience will go to the person who's alive. Like it'll like double up their experience. Or it'll give them the experience that the other character would have gotten, you know? Great fair, I tell you what. It's funny that nobody else is in here fighting the bot, it's just us. Nobody else is brave enough to fight Gato, I guess. Afraid of his big fucking boxing glove penis coming out and hitting him in the face. <laughs> How many points? Well, I sold a lot of them before. Now, I'm not sure how many I got. I'm, I'm just gonna do it. I'm, I'm, I'm farming them a bunch. I think I'll check my points at like 8.20. 8.06 where I'm at right now, so. Like 15 minutes or so. Check the points. Bob is the only man who sleeps with a wooden sword. Dude, every man sleeps and wakes up with a wooden sword at one point. Not the only. Oh shit. Well, that's a like spike. I appreciate it, guys. 24 likes. What? <laughs> what, Lele? What are we What's wrong? You could say Bob's got morning. Oh God. <laughs> That's the whole reason we're farming this bot is so that we can get some real steel. Literally, why? Let's go! Saki Saki! Heal me! Quickly! Be healed, my son! Thank you, Evolution. 
can get healed, nerd. Fucking nerd, get healed. Kind of funny, it's like we just met this girl. She just bumped into us randomly. And now <laughs> she's like helping me fight this robot over and over and over again. Be healed, my son. This one likes my guy. All the support, guys, really, really means a lot to me. Run out of MP, we're gonna have to go sleep, but. I'm afraid the robot's music will be stuck in my mind for the rest of the day. <laughs> it's pretty good. Why? Can't carry any more silver points. What? So there's a limit? Okay. I didn't know that. Oh, 200? Okay, so that's the limit. We'll just have to exchange. Now we have zero and then start the farming again. <laughs> I, I didn't even know there was a cat like that. What's your question, Evolution? Is Gato, like, rapping when he's singing? Because I, I feel like he's rapping. I don't know why. He's like, not you two again. Dude, we're giving him business. I don't know. I don't know. Like, that's what he was built for. I'm pretty sure we're the only ones going back there. He'd be a lonely robot if it wasn't thanks to us. Yes, 200 points give you 1k gil. Yeah, yeah, that would be the math. That would be the math, actually. <laughs> So we need to hit the cap a couple more times and we'll be good. SA <laughs> okay. 2290, we're halfway there, boys. Halfway there, halfway there. They call me God. I got metal joints. Beat me up. Give you the fucking points. Bitch. Whoa, God. Oh, there's no need for name calling, dude. Oh, big fucking crit. Big crit. Finish him off rain. Oh. Wait, what? That should have killed him. He's got to be getting stronger. Oh my god, he's, t he's taking me to town right now. Get out of here. He must have had like two health left or something. I'm over leveled and I'm gonna have an OP weapon to boot. This is how you gotta do it in RPG, guys. You gotta train hard, get the good equipment. 
Get the hot bitty to help you. That's it, dude. Game's over. We basically already won the game. It's just an interactive story at this point. Heal me quickly. Our heels are getting stronger, too. Want you? Leveled up, nice. So let me do the math here. So that was the second time we fought him, so now we have 30 points. So... 84 times... X. So 12. Every 12 times we'll stop. Won't be the third time. Kato has the patience of a saint. He's a robot, man. He's programmed to get beat up over and over again. This is what he's living for. It's all good with it. Like, beat boop, dude. Fucking molest me. That's <laughs> It's like, hurt me, snake. Please, dog. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Um... Big boom. Dude, look at our HP. We got over 100 now. You know what? <laughs> hurt me more, snake. <laughs> Whoa, what the f- He's like, hurt me. <laughs> like, if you stick that wooden sword up my processor, I'll give you 50,000 points. <laughs> got a deal, got a. <laughs> Like, oh, you hit the limit. Only 200. <laughs> wait, wait. This is the fourth time, right? Or is it the fifth? Ah, oh, shit. Is there a way to check your points, like, without talking to somebody? <laughs> yeah, three-digit HPs now, boys. We're, we're, we're rolling with the big boys now. Like, me and this girl are gonna roll up into Velma's house just, like, ripped. Like, ripped as hell, dude. Are you guys, um, sure that we can't go grab Velma and then bring her here and get everyone XP? Because that would be more ideal if we were getting three people XP instead of just two. You know what I'm saying? So... I don't know if that's the case or not, but... We can grab her and bring her here and still do this. Might be able to? Oh, later in the game she can be brought here? Later in the game. You don't want to get Velma until you're done since you'll progress the game, I believe. Okay. I figured. Just wanted to be sure. So, like, what? If I went straight to Velma's and didn't go to this fair, I wouldn't have been able to do any of this shit? Mommy Gato. Have the fat. Never mind. 
¿Qué vais a venir? Like two shot on him now. I mean, I hit him with a nasty crit, but pretty much two shot on him. funny that if you like farmed him enough times eventually he's just like all right guys that's enough <laughs> like wait what like i can't do it no mo you're programmed to take an ass whooping it's just it's just turns out it's just a guy in a suit not even a fucking robot almost a fucking con artist dude <laughs> she didn't actually build a robot Fight. That music sounds like something out of RuneScape, though. I don't know about you guys. Would it cost one MP, like, in the... Wait! I could have sworn it cost two. Does it cost two in battle and only one outside of battle, like in the menu? That's... wow. Huh. Oh yeah, we gotta leave and come back. And I'm gonna do like three more. It always costs one? Really? I could have sworn it was costing two. Or anyway. I'll do like three more and then we're gonna go turn in the point. He really likes me, I tell you. world is two. Oh, okay. I gotcha. text use the MP of both characters involved in the attack? Oh, wow. I thought I noticed that, that it was like taking both of their mana. But you can only heal one more time and then we'll have to go rest it up. Yeah, me too, Evolution. Like, way back when. I didn't play it much, though. I got uh, one more time, and then I'm gonna go turn in my points and take take a little nappy. I'll be back to beat your ass some more. <laughs> sings us a new song he's like oh baby before you two came along i had no one no one to beat on me oh baby beat on me what's wrong with that i ask you what Dude, his metal joints are nice and lubed up after all. 
Now then. Turn in some points. 50, nice. Thank you, come again. to head back home for a little nap go in the door and we're both just ripped as hell mom's like oh my god what happened I've been working out with Gatto Gatto's training regimen survives a war, so I'm sure this is just duty calls to him. Was he, like, in a war or something? I thought Velma just built him. What'd this guy say? Demo Velma's uh, robot battle trainer. Robot battle trainer. Gato, I'm back. I hate to say it, but I'm all healed up, matted up. Be getting that ass whoop. What part from leaving mom's house uh, do you see Professor Oak in the tall grass in this game? I don't know, man. I'm just waiting to pick my first Pokemon. Uh, do you think they're gonna... Wait, where do you think they're going to go with Kingdom Hearts? I mean, they're probably going to do Kingdom Hearts 4. Big crits. But we could hit a 69, guys. Imagine if we crit 69. Oh, my God. That'd be the highlight of the stream. Highlight of the stream, boys. there we're at 3,000 gil guys 3,000 gil I'm pretty much gonna do this until it says I'm capped again and we'll turn them in. We should have 4,000. Um, and then I'm going to buy the sword. And then we're going to farm him just a little bit more with the new sword. To see how powerful it is. And, and we'll turn those in. Get some gill back. Maybe we'll buy. We can buy some equipment too, maybe. I don't know. And we'll finally go see Velma. <laughs> All geared out and like buff as hell. She's like, what the hell? <laughs> Like, sup, nerd? <laughs> no, I'm no cab. I mean, um, we're all we need is a thousand more gil, and we'll have the four thousand. 
guys think should we should we speed this up you guys think we should speed this up hold on let me save state before i do it because speeding up can make things a little unstable Definitely help them with these iffy load times, I'll tell you that much. I am speed. I'm telling you, he loves my ass. Like, he'll attack me more than anything. I don't know if that's just some crazy fucking coincidence, or probably not. The fisting looks so bad now. Calling it a fisting seems even worse. Definitely doesn't help calling it a fisting. <laughs> God. Gotta trying to KO Bob and steal your girl. Well, he's KO'd me a couple times and my girl beat his ass, so. look really bad especially when he does it to her it looks so bad is there gonna be a church of bob probably not unless unless he ends up walking on water at some point in this playthrough I get it. So she uses her healing ability, and then he somehow like takes the energy of that, and then like spins around with his sword and it and pushes all the energy outward to heal everybody. Something like that. That's kind of cool. Neato. I dare say Nito Guido. Stop fisting, Nigato. Give me my points. Big crit, 70, wow. Why couldn't we have hit 69? Clockwork now. So can you only do the dual text when both of their um Oh there you go. When both of their like I guess their time their time gauges are ready. That's 
but like it needs to be both players' turns in order for the uh, the John to go off, you know. But that's what it seems like. It would make sense. But then it like uses up both of their turns. a sexy sword. What up, old man? Like, you wanna grab my sexy sword, do you, sonny? Like, oh, no, no. <laughs> hold up. Hold up, old man. I'm talking about the load sword here, alright? Get it. Oh, we only got 40 gil left. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, we'll sell our old wooden sword. By the way, Talk to that young lady. Wait. Talk that young lady into selling her pendant? No, dude. Piss off. Fuck. <laughs> Old ass weirdo. Alright. Uh... Dude, that's great. That's fucking great. Just like won't do business with me anymore because I wouldn't convince her. <laughs> Only 50 gil. And my wooden sword was only worth 10 silver points, guys. Is this like a quest or something? Is this important? Or what? Probably not. I'm gonna say no again. Alright. Now we're gonna go farm him a little bit more just so we can get some gil back. Not be completely fucking broke. And I want to see how much damage I do now with this dude. What up, Gato? You want to check out my new sword, dude? It's all thanks to you. Chewing. Oh, it's sexy looking, dude. It's like blue. Damn! 58 base hit! Oh my god. I think we can now two-shot him every single time. Affect something minor later in the game. Yeah, yeah, crit hit should be over 100. That's insane. Like, we could one-shot him. If we crit him, we'll one-shot his fat ass. Gato, bend over and let me one-shot you, dude. See them hundreds, that three digit. Three digits popping up. Bitch! Oh. Come on, Gato. Be healed, my son. That crit! Ow. Big fucking damage. You could probably one shot with Cyclone. I might be able to. Let me. I'm gonna try it. Try and one shot him with the Cyclone. Prepare yourself. Oh my god! Yeah, we can almost one-shot him. Oh, like, he, he only has a couple digits of health left after the Cyclone. Yes, 76 HP. I love how you know his exact HP. So he had four health left after the Cyclone. That's nuts, dude. The fact that we can't one-shot him, though, is kind of... Like, unless we can one-shot him, it's not worth it to waste mana with the Cyclone. Oh. Get 
the cyclone crit? Because if it could crit, that'd be insane. That'd be 140 fucking damage. I don't know. Oh, there's like a scan mechanic in the game? That's cool. Cyclone cannot crit. I figured. Usually, like that, can't crit. It'd be too busted if they could. Lucas starts with an accessory that reveals... Oh, that's fancy. She's Velma, right? The one we named Velma. I'm gonna speed it up. Time to get that farming in. Noise. A lot of the enemies HP, even the bosses. Oh. Well, Gamer X, sounds like you may be a valuable asset to have in this playthrough. Kind of addicted to farming this guy, I gotta be honest with you. <laughs> thousand just to just to have really wish I would get a credit We're capped. Okay, I'm level six. Holy shit. You level six too? Wait. Oh. oh, she's level seven. Okay, so she must have just leveled up. Yeah, I'm really close to leveling. <laughs> yeah, Taco. She's, he's been pissing the shit out of her head fucking all night. Let me speed up through this. It's like it's so tedious.
And all of my dude catch us soon. Thanks, Johnny, for coming. Have a good night, man. Okay. Got, we should have over a thousand. A thousand forty, I'm guessing. No, a thousand ninety. Okay. So now, do you think we should buy some equipment? Perhaps. Twenty-four and eighteen. So that's five. I guess each of them gives an extra five. That's not bad. I can buy one for each of us and then we'll be broke again. <laughs> you know what? You know what? Fuck it. If I do that right, then we can just go, we can just go farm them again. <laughs> we can just go farm them to cap again and then get another thousand and just keep it. Is it worth? I mean, with the speed up, it won't take that long. Okay, I bought it for me. Hold on. Oh yeah, the reason we have a uh, thousand ninety is because I sold my wooden sword that gave me the extra fifty on top of the. Floor. I can sell my old hide cap and tunic for some money. And same with hers. Velma's device is all set up. She's at the north end of the square. Wait, they, wait what? Velma's here? Does that mean I don't gotta go visit her at her house? Ready for some more Gato? Look, I thought we were done. I crit! Holy shit, that was 108. I literally one shot his ass. Holy crap, holy. I crit 108 on him. And I leveled up. Now we can definitely two shot him every time, I think. Gato's pleading at this point. It's like, please! Help me for the love of God, help me. Oh, she can provoke him now. Did she just... Did she... Did that actually confuse him? I don't think so. That was funny. She, like, slapped her ass a few times. Like, what the hell? Oh, come on, big boy. Like, I am a robot. I have no emotions. I cannot be provoked. <laughs> Don't lie to us, Gato. 
We can see the sexual tension within your soul, my dude. We can say it! He's like, please, I'm just a fucking robot. <laughs> I'm back, bitches! <laughs> What's up, Dragonborn? Dragonborn's back, everybody. Back from his hiatus. He, he took a little hiatus and he's back. Very naughty robot, dude. The big naughty boy. You know what? That's it. No more farming them. We're done, guys. We're done. Let's go turn in the points. Oh, we have an uneven number. Shit. Okay, let me farm them one more time. to get that fisting in one more time, boys. Have a good night, Lele. Don't forget to get fisted, Rage. Th thanks, dude. Appreciate it. Okay. What was this about the North Square? Well, your horses, uh, I want to get some candy! Candy! Okay. Give us a second. Okay. <laughs> Hi, I'd like some of this. Don't worry, young lady. We're waiting. Really? Yeah, it's like... <laughs> okay. You got your candy, now let's go. Uh, what the hell? Hello? Step right on up. This is not medieval times, dude. This is like some technology they got going on here. Any of you who have the time and the courage, our Super Dimension Warp is the invention of the century. Super Dimension Warp? To use it, jump on up here and you'll get teleported here. It's the masterwork of my beautiful daughter, Velma. She invented a teleporter? Like straight up? Hey, hey, hey Velma, I was supposed to go visit you at your house, but I got caught up fighting a robot that you invented, and I'm sorry. Bob! Where have you been? No one wants to try the telepod. How about you? It looks like fun. I'll watch while you try it out. Hop onto the left pod. Okay, I, I, I don't have a good feeling about this, guys. Um, but, oh, here we go. Hold on. Begin energy transfer. Oh god. Oh god! Shit! Wow, that was great! worked? Am I all in one piece? You'll be fine. I'm like back to level one again. <laughs> My sword's gone. It's like, oh, I'm sorry. Your sword must have got lost in the dimensional rift or something. Like, what are you talking about? Like, I just farmed for an hour and a half for that sword. That would suck. Somebody else won't. Wait, what? What do you mean? How was it? Wanna try it again? Uh, what a kick! I want to try it too. Huh? Bob, how did you pick up a cutie like her? Hang on, Bob. I'll be right there. Behold, ladies and gentlemen, as this vision of loveliness steps aboard the machine. 
Vision of loveliness. Wait, wait. If this is if this is Thelma's father, he's got to be like in his 40s or something. And this girl's only like what, like 15, probably 14. Who knows? And he's like vision of loveliness. God, don't go away. I'll be right back. Sure about this. There's still time to change your mind. No way. Throw the switch. Like throw the switch, bitches. Hey everyone, uh, let's give her a big hand when she tell when she reappears. Long, dude. Long. Uh oh, it's her pendant. What's happening? My, my pendant. That's. Oh. Uh -huh. Oh boy. What the. F Yo, what the frick, Velma? You just you just disintegrated my girlfriend, dude! Velma, where is she? Show's over, folks. Uh, let's head along now. <laughs> it's like nothing to see here. <laughs> like, w when's she gonna come out on the other side? Everybody just leaves. <laughs> What's going on, Thelma? Where is she? Maybe she disappeared. Couldn't have been the telepod. Her field seemed to be affected by her pendant. What are we going to do now? So familiar. I know I've seen her somewhere. Gotta get her pendant. What happened? Ah! Actually going to do it? What a fine lad! Wait, wait, what? Do what? No, I, I was just grabbing her pendant. Wait a minute! No, wait, what are you talking about? I was just grabbing her goddamn pendant. Listen, I don't know where this machine is going to send you, but we haven't any other choice. Won't they both be lost? This is our only hope. That pendant seems to be the key. Well, hang on to it, Bob, and brace yourself, guys. Wait a minute! I was literally just grabbing the pendant. <laughs> Please. I'M NOT READY FOR THIS! Like, it, could, it could send me anywhere, it could send me into the fucking void, dude! I don't know where I'm gonna go! Power to full. Roger, roger! Oh my god, dude. There, we did it! Oh my god. I'll follow you after I know what we're what went wrong. Good luck, Bob. Good Lord, man. Silent protagonist problems, dude. Whoa, this is trippy. What the fuck? I told you, dude, we're going into the void. We're going to the eighth dimension to fight the fucking monkey man. Okay, this doesn't look so bad. Like a forest or something. What the fuck? Hello? Hello? Stay back. I trained with Gato. I'm warning you, little creeps. All right, that's how you want it, huh? Take this! Oh ho ho! What's Gucci with it? Hey, you see what I just did to your friends there, huh? You see? I don't want, you don't want to mess with this. <laughs> We're so busted, dude. This place ain't no match for us. Although we are a little bit weak. Yeah, we never healed after all the training with Gato. Oh no, that's going to put us at a disadvantage and we don't have any items. Still have the pendant? It's weird that she dropped the pendant when she got teleported, but I managed to hold on to it. We don't have any items. Oh shit. And Bob was never seen again. Hope that's not the case. 
Hear that noise? Here we go. What was that? Guys, right, so where the hell are we? Can we go back in time or something? I mean, that would make sense. Like chrono trigger and all that, you know, it's, it's about time. I don't know. Here you little demons. Ooh, the big fucking crit. These enemies seem to have gill on them. Same currency that I use. One power glove. A power glove. That do. Probably raises my strength or something. Yeah, nice. I like it. This is the bandana. Guy? Boop boop beep boop <laughs> pants of the monkey. <laughs> What's up, Nico? Welcome. Increases my speed by one. I think I'd rather have the power. Then again, do I need the power? I don't. These things get one-shotted by me, so I think the speed is more important. Save the power glove for later, though. I think right now, speed is definitely more important. Oh. Kid, what's this? A tonic! Oh, thank God, I'm taking it right now, dude. I freaking love it too, Nico. <laughs> Definitely one of the best audio intros that have ever been, ever been chosen. Ice. Didn't full health us, but uh, it's better than nothing. Off we go. Find our girlfriend. Playing ball. What? What are these children? Wait a minute. What? That's not a ball? <laughs> Wait a second. What is this place? So can I only attack two at a time, or can I attack three? Now I can only attack two. Come here. Get some. guys must have like low dexterity or something because I'm critting them a lot. Oh, we got a tonic off that guy. Get it. I'll take it. it. Should bring me really close to full health. Ahem. You can run around enemies if you choose and are able. Wait, really? Like, in the battle, you can run around enemies? Try and do that. Where the hell? Market? Residence? It's like we're in some kind of alternate reality or something, man. Check out the market. Would have loved Sudoken. Well, I could play it one day, man. It may win a PlayStation Saturdays one day. Keep putting it on there every time we uh, do a new poll. Look at this guy. You're going to fight Magus's army? Wonderful, but remember to equip your... We're in the past. Oh, God, we're in the past. Oh, my God, we're in the past before they defeated this Magus guy. Oh my, that was a, all the mentioning of, the mentionings of him were like a foreshadow, I guess. Oh shit. No window shoppers, what do you want? Dude, we're like over 400 years in the past. Yeah, give me some tonics. I'll take 10 tonics, my dude. Uh, I'll take 10 heals as well. And, uh... I'll take a revive just in case. And a shelter. Thank you. Okay. Uh, things just got real, boys. We're in the fucking past. 
Wait, we are probably the people that defeated the evil wizard or whatever the fuck, dude. That's probably what it is. Like, we're the ones that defeated him. Dude, things always get nutty in these kinds of games when it deals with time. Oh no, on the field? Oh, you mean you can avoid them, I gotcha. A millennial fair? Here? What are you talking about? The year is 600, and the 21st King of Guardia reigns. See, we're in the past, guys, my god. We've been at war for years, when will it end? This is insane, guys, we, we're in the fucking past. This is why you don't mess with teleporters and dimensional shit, and this, this is why. I hate time travel, <laughs> what's up, Patai? Time travel's a fun concept, but it can get pretty goofy. The rules can get very distorted and... Oh, is this the bell? I'm, I'm Banta, the blacksmith. I'm forging a bell for the king to present to the beloved queen, Lene. Yeah, Lene's bell, this is it, he's making it. I lost it when the queen disappeared. I just couldn't keep working on the bell. Now it's back to business as usual. Can't believe it, dude, this is the fucking bell. He's making it. My husband wants a daughter who is as intelligent as she is beautiful. How are we going to get out of the past? Here's the true sin. This is literally the town, but just way back when. My stats looking like is yeah, I, maybe I could sleep at the end. Yeah, yeah, let's definitely sleep. MP and everything. Holy crap. Well, uh, good thing about Trigger, Gothic says, is that it does things on a linear time, sort of like Back to the Future 1. It's not like quantum mechanics with alternate universes like Back to the Future 2. Okay. But you see, that always causes problems because it's like paradoxes and shit, you know what I mean? Like space-time continuums fucking up and all that sort of junk. I don't know. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Talk to me. Who's the innkeep here? Oh, is it you? Engil, yeah. It's nice to know that over 400 years, these guys have keep, kept their prices the same. <laughs> Look, it's one of these things. This has been apparently jarring. Still sealed by mysterious forces. Is this the same exact box, too? But I don't know. And, and where the hell is Rain, dude? Where's she at? Where you at, Rain? People got to say. Money affair. What? Are you crazy? What nonsense? Am I? Are you stupid? This is the kingdom of Gar Guardia. We're battling Magus's army. Did know of that, uh, right? Uh, of course. Shut your pie hole. Jeez, people are rude here, man. What a relief. They finally found Queen Lene wandering up in the mountains. Must be glad to be home. Aegis's army destroyed the Man Bridge? The South Continent is accessible. This guy just walked in. Tama. Are you a stranger here too? I'm Tama, the, the explorer. If you're buying, I'll tell you a story. How about it? Okay. Cider, please. Thanks. It's about a missing queen. She disappeared while visiting that cathedral to the west and... Beg your pardon? What? They found her? Never mind. What? Oh god, I hope I didn't just lose Gil for no reason. <laughs> okay, let's get out of here. The game that I play using time travel method was Tales of... Fantasia. You don't encounter too much paradox stuff. It's more like... Wait. 
EOTF1? What's BOTF? I actually don't know what BOTF is, dude. I'm sorry. Yeah, cider, right? Uh huh, right, yeah. He wants a big fat beer. That's what he's. That's what he. Guardia Forest? Could she be in there? In the bridge, yeah. Oh, Back to the Future. Okay. You just. You call him BOTF. Yeah, back, back of the future is like what you were saying. Uh, the bridge is being fixed because Magus' army trashed it. Trashed it. But until Sir Cyrus returns, we'll fight Magus' army's tooth and nail. Good lord, man. Got heartburn, gamer? That sucks. Well, I guess our only lead here is to go into the forest. Oh. We gotta, we gotta find Rain. We gotta find her. Found one power tab. Shit. I didn't actually think there'd be something under that rock. Love the music here. It's kind of, it's kind of peaceful. Power plus one. Oh, is it like a permanent increase? Yeah, it's a permanent increase to power. That's cool. You likey that? Ico's guides are so good. They are, yeah. They're they're great classic guides. And the BC guides, too. Oh, there's something here. What? Oh, no. The hell? What are these green fucking goblins riding these little ball creatures and shit? Like, what the fuck? Shit, I should have waited till they were together. Holy Rider, they're called. Come here, you. That's all right. Just see the sword like a badass. She, 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 the sword. She. Power tab, even stack boost. Fucking tab item. This was glimmering. Shit. Gone. I literally saw this glowing a second ago. Guess you gotta be quick or something. Yeah, they have similar things in Legend of Ligaia. I'm actually seeing a lot of similarities between Ligaia and this game. At least mechanics-wise. And here's more of these assholes. The goblins look so funny. Let's see if I can get all three of these guys in a cyclone. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Big AoE damage. Goodbye. Cyclone, oh fucking P. Little bastards ain't no match for me. Imps look like they know something. They look like Garlic Jr., <laughs> don't they? Like, go look at, go look up a picture of Garlic Jr. and then look at those imps, dude. Birds? What the frick? And birds. Blue eaglets? <laughs> They're like dive bombing me. Get out of here, dude. What the fuck? Like the vultures in Final Fantasy X. Get out of here. Going into the woods, killing all this wildlife. <laughs> Trapped in the fucking 
the past, man. This is scary. I can only assume that once we find uh, Rain, maybe Velma will come. And she seems like a fucking genius, so she'll probably figure out some way. Like, she'll figure out that we went back to the past, and then she'll invent some kind of time machine. Probably come rescue us and take us back to the present. Hello? Oh, well... You know what? I'm gonna try for another cyclone. Then again, they're nowhere near each other. Throw it. Like when they're together like that, they count as one monster, and they're very easy to one shot, so. Oh man! Okay, yeah. Maybe the imps are working for this, uh, this mage or whatever. Holy lord. What are these things? They're called rollies. They almost look like slimes or something. Oh, you missed me. You missed me, bud. All our training with Gato really paid off. <laughs> we are strong as hell. Oh, I learned Slash. Nice. Slash do. Might be a single target. Any chocobo in here? <laughs> Yo, they are making noises that's kind of similar to a chocobo. Flash attack. Okay. But yeah, it's probably just a single target. Probably save that for like a boss then or something. At this point, you should be killing the first boss. Probably. Okay, I guess the first boss is gonna be coming up, right? Is it gonna be some big monster in this wood? I'm gonna have to show him my big wood. I mean, steel, steel, it's steel now. I don't have a big wood sword no more. It's a big steel sword. Is it made of steel? I don't know. I don't know what it's made of, but it's definitely made of something better than wood. This. Uh, the forest leads north. Guardia Castle. Oh, we gotta keep heading north. Yeah, I guess we gotta go to the castle and be like, yo, what the flip, guys? I'm in the- uh, oh, oh god. You guys look like you want a cyclone. I, I don't know. Group up, group up, group up, group up. Group up for me, boys. Come on, I know you, you know you wanna, you know you wanna group up. Oh, I just missed it. Oh well. It's it's kind of cool how there's a skill to that. Like you got to be quick. Like when they all group up together, you just got to be quick with it, or else you're just not gonna hit them all. You're big what now? No, you heard nothing, Serena. You heard nothing. You heard nothing. Okay. Keep heading north. How you doing, Graham? Welcome. This is actually my first playthrough here, so... Oh, one of these mysterious boxes again. All sealed by some mysterious force. I guess it's something that you gotta come back for later. Dead end ahead. Should lead to the castle. Yeah, here we go. think Rain's in here? Halt! Who goes there? Check out check out that hair. Where are you from, son? You one of those ma mages as troopers? <laughs> it's it's totally like Back to the Future vibes, because it's like we're in the past and we're dressed strangely like compared to them. They're just like, what the hell? Hardly this kid uh would have would have made the cut. Never would have made the cut. Show us your stamp collection, son. Haha, <laughs> now beat it, shrimp! Stop that at once, dude. All these soldiers are assholes. Queen Lene! Oh my, it's the queen herself. I've heard many stories. Show your manners. This is a friend of mine. What? But, but there's something odd about him. Refuse to obey my orders? 
F forgive me, my lady. Uh, uh, please enter, sir. Sir, please. Giggle. How am I? Fr How am I? What? What? No. No, 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 no. Don't tell me. Don't fucking tell me. Is that Rain? Is that her? She became the fucking queen? Did she go back like way, way further than I did? And she ended up becoming queen somehow? No. No, dude. No. Dude. Sir, I understand that you were the one who saved my dear wife, the queen. Your wife? What? But can you tell me what happened? Lene is acting rather odd. She seems to have lost her coral pin, which is something she guarded with her life. Forgive me, you must be tired. We can talk about this later. Please rest in the king in the knight's quarters downstairs to the left. So she... She went back in time, changed her name, married this old fucker. You gotta be kidding me, no. There's no fucking way. Hmm. What? What are you hmmming about, dude? Don't follow this guy. Guys, I'm tripping out. Hello? Dude, what? You're like climbing a tap. Yeah. What's up, old man? Hmm. What? What do you want? Get out of my face! Jesus, dude! Okay, then. <laughs> like, what the hell? What's the point of that? Oh. Where is she? I'd say the Chancellor's going crazy, but I don't believe it. Chancellor's a decent man. Why, he goes to the cathedral every day. Ah. Huh. He is kind of just wandering around going, hmm. Guys, this is crazy. I gotta find her, dude. No way. Awaits. Okay. Oh my God, don't fucking tell me, Rain. There's no fucking way. Is it you? Ah, there you are. Please leave us. I need to talk to this individual. Certainly, Your Highness. Freaking, but really hard. Come nearer, sir. Okay. Giggle. That's <laughs> like. Told you, didn't I, Bob? It's me, but everyone calls me Lene. What the fuck? How did you? I'm so relieved you're here. We barely know each other, but somehow I knew you'd come for me. Dude, how the what the? How long have you been here? She must have been here like years or something, right? Or. Thank you, Bob. Something's wrong. What? Whoa! What's happening? Feels like I'm being torn apart. What? Feels like you're being torn apart. Oh, is it that time of the month? Oh, yeah, it might be that time of the month, boys. All right, well, we'll just leave her to her business then, I guess. That's some crazy shit, dude. You dismissed you already? You were polite, of course. Funny, did you? Oh, uh, well, yeah. No, no, of course not. Is she okay? Wait a minute. Help me, Bob! I'm scared! Please, Bob, help me! 
What the frick? Okay. Um, comes the first case of timeline problems. I was thinking, like, is it because she's not meant to be in this timeline and so she got, like, fucking ripped away from it somehow now? Is it gonna happen to me too? How long has she been here? Is she? I can't tell if she actually became the queen and that's how it was always supposed to be or if she's just pretending. Because they said that the queen went missing and then came back and maybe she just so happens to look like the queen and so they thought it was her, right? And so she's just playing along. I think that's what actually happened. Either way... Fuck. Tired of the gossip around. I gotta get the fuck out of here, dude. They're gonna think I killed her or something. I got no clue. Like, what am I supposed to do now? I found her and she fucking warped away. Bob! Oh, oh, the Baha. See, I told you she'd come. You're okay. Did you find the girl? Well, yes and no. Gone? What do you mean she's gone? Just as I thought. Just as you thought? What do you mean? I knew I recognized her. This looks identical to the castle in our time. I'll bet they mistook that girl for her ancestor. She's- oh, I told you. She, she's a member of the royal family in our time. She's Princess Nadia. <laughs> Bob's like, what? <laughs> Rain, that is. Princess Nadia is a descendant of Queen Lene. Well, that makes sense. Queen Lene has been kidnapped. I recall someone was supposed to, s to have saved her, but history has been changed. <gasps> oh no, we changed history. A looks so much like Lene. Rene. Rain looks so much like Lene. I'm saying Rene. That they probably called off their search when she appeared here. But if the real queen is killed. Oh, man! So she got wiped from existence! That's what happened! Rain will simply disappear, dude. Oh my god, she got martied, guys! She literally got martied! She disappeared, that's what happened! Might still be time. If we can save Lene, history as we know should remain unchanged. Oh my god. Now I see what this game's gonna be about. Something must have happened to the Queen in this era. As a result, Prince Nadia ceases to exist. Hurry, we have to find the real Queen! Oh my god, well, where the hell could she be?! Good lord, guys, she got fucking erased! So what, we got, um... We got Velma in our party now? Yeah, she's in our part. She's only level two, dude. <laughs> she's only level two. Look at her. She's fire. Got an air gun. I'm gonna give her the power glove. Yeah, it'll definitely help her. What's the sight scope do? Oh, it shows the enemy's HP. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, that's what you were talking about. But I'd rather have the power glove. She's only level two, so it'll help her hit a little harder. But, uh, okay, I think that's gonna do it, boys, for the first episode of Let's Stream Chrono Trigger. It, it, really fun game so far. This is a very interesting story. I like how it's, um, like you said, Gothic, it's that kind of timeline where things are changeable. Like, it's not multi-dimensional, it's like single dimensions, so anything you do in the past will affect your future. Which is really interesting, really, really interesting. 
Um, and I look forward to the rest of it. I'm saving twice, I don't know why. But, uh, yeah, we'll be back next Saturday, uh, 7 p.m. Eastern, as always, for more PlayStation Saturdays and more Chrono Trigger. But thanks for joining me on the first episode, guys. It was a lot of fun. Sorry that a lot of it was grinding, but, yeah, I'm, I'm looking forward to the next episode here. Again, guys, thanks so much for joining me, and until next time, I'll catch you later, Box Bros. Peace out!